Hi, I'm Jenny from Boat Specialists, and today we're going to talk to you guys about our top selling boats from Highfield. We have the Highfield Classic and the Ultralight Flat Deck. Now, one of the most common questions we get from our customers is, what's the difference between these two boats? So, I'm gonna walk through the different features on these boats, but ultimately, it comes down to weight. Let's start with um, our Classic. Both of these boats uh, that we're using as an example are 290, which is 9.6 in length. So for the Classic 290, this weighs 130 pounds, um, can hold up to four passengers, and takes a 20 horsepower motor. We'll start first with all classics have uh, the ventilated bow locker. This is great, it gives a ton of storage space and can hold up to a um, six gallon fuel tank. They also come with the bow cushion, which is nice and comfortable. And the bow step here is actually a manufacturer um, option, but here at Boat Specialists, all of the classics that we bring on um, actually include the bow step. Customers love them, we love them. It makes it super easy to get in and out of the boat. And you will also see here the cleat for um, your anchor. Moving on to the floor of the classics, all of these are dual layered aluminum floor. You'll see too that they include um, really nice EVA foam deck, which is non-slip, non but also nice because it's gonna keep you in your belongings dry throughout the whole ride. You'll see too, with a dual layer aluminum floor, you can actually run the fuel line hose from your tank uh, to your motor at the transom. All classics come with eight uh, handle attachments. It also has a heavy duty rub strake that runs around the entire boat. And these rub strakes are designed to push the water down, so it actually deflects spray throughout your ride. The boat's self-bailing, so you'll see here, uh, it has a self-bailing valve. Another cool feature about the Classics on the Highfield is that they have a heavy-duty transom plate. And you'll see here, too, that they actually include a lip. This is great um, for your motor. It adds stability. It makes it super easy to clamp the motor on and keep it on. Couple other things you'll see, they have the patched rings. Um, you'll see four of them there. This is, makes it super easy if you wanted to add a bimini to your boat. And with the classics, you'll see on the inside too that they have four lifting points for davits. That pretty much covers the classic. Let's move into the ultralight. It's gonna have a lot of similar features to the classic, but the goal here is to be as light as possible. So. First big difference you'll see is in the ultralight, it does not have a bow locker, um, but you will see here that it has a shelf for the fuel tank, as well as a strap to keep it in place. With the flat deck, it's dual layer aluminum, uh, similar to the classic, so you can, you do have the option to run the fuel line hose um, from the bow uh, to the motor on the transom. But another feature about the ultralight that's pretty cool is it actually has attachments on the inside of the tube. So if you didn't want to run it under the hull, you could just run it along uh, the side there, or you could run uh, your boat lines there as well. Again, Highfield has the heavy duty um, uh, welded aluminum transom, as well as the heavy duty plate here for your motor. Uh, one of the things I didn't touch on, but that both um, of the models have they come with attachments for two seats, and it does, every boat includes one seat um, that actually floats. Both of our Highfield models come with this um, seat cushion and underseat storage bag, as well as uh, the following accessories. So you get a foot pump, a dry bag, a document bag, which also carries uh, your manual, you can put your registration information in here, comes with some stickers, a key float, a compass, a thermometer and whistle, and a high field pen. 
And then we also have a patch kit. For the ultralight, they have a lightweight rub strake, um, 360 around the boat. Both boats have a heavy duty keel guard that runs all the way through the hull. And uh, another cool thing to touch on with Highfield is you can see here that the oars are set up with the oar locks at the top part of the tubes, but um, they also have these straps on the inside, which the Classic does as well. So if you wanted to, you could get the oars um, out of the way, move them to the inside of the tube. This frees up all that space for passengers um, to sit, but also makes it much easier for you to get in and out of the boat when uh, you're in the water. Now, um, I think you guys have a good idea of the differences between these two boats. You get a, a ton of features, durability with the Classic, coming in at 130 pounds. Again, can hold up to four uh, passengers and take a 20 horsepower motor. And then you have the ultralight uh, flat deck that weighs 99 pounds, can still hold four passengers and take a 15 horsepower. Thanks so much for watching our video and we hope to see you soon.